you remember what bruschetta is? A lot of times in restaurants when they say bruschetta, they mean toasted bread with something on it. Well, bruschetta itself is just the toasted bread. It's even better with a little salt, a little olive oil on it, but it's even better when you do make some kind of a topping for it. Here's an easy summer topping, especially if you've got a lot of tomatoes and basil and garlic and all those good summer things. And if you we used canned tomatoes, you can do that too. What you do is you get a can of plum tomatoes. Now this is a 28 ounce can of plum tomatoes. You open them up, put them in a bowl, and you crush them lightly with your fingers till they're just breaking apart. Then you take about ah, a pint of cherry tomatoes, cut them in half, and you throw those in too. Put in some parsley, some basil, some salt and pepper to taste. And then you put in some little, little tiny, I think they call it chichinlio, ch ch I don't know how they, what they call it. I call it little mozzarella balls. And you cut those in half and you throw those in. And you put some parsley in and you mix it all up. Did I mention garlic? You gotta have garlic. Now, how are you gonna put that soupy thing on a, on a piece of bread? Well, you can't. You've gotta strain it first through the strainer and you're gonna save that wonderful flavorful juice and you're probably gonna use that in um, gazpacho or some tomato sauce or something. And as that goes through the sieve and it dries out a little bit, you're gonna put this in your bowl and you're gonna serve that to your guests with little pieces of toast and have them make it themselves. I mean, you don't wanna pre-make them or it'll be soggy. And there you've got a lovely, wonderful little summer treat with some of the fruit of the vine. Not the wine, but the tomato. I'm Father Paul Sile. Till next time, God bless.